Hello YouTube, Oya Fiegel here, and this is a video response for Mr. George Arms, who is having an on-target giveaway. It's pretty cool. Check out his video and check out those prizes. Really impressive. So thanks a lot for that, and congratulations on, on all your subs that you're that you're you've gotten and that you are getting uh, with this giveaway. He's going up to 250. I'm sure he'll hit it. Um, also, he wants to uh, have us discuss. Uh, our opinions of on gun control and he mentioned how it's kind of fashionable now for the gun grabbers to want to disarm the population and of course anyone with uh, an intelligence and any knowledge of history knows that this is a pretty bad idea uh, of course anyone else who feels that uh, they need the government to take care of them and um, uh, who live under the delusion that by taking guns away from legal owners that all the guns will magically disappear from the possession of the criminals. Um, no, it never works, never will work. Uh, in fact, it is my belief that, um, that gun control is uh, pretty much owning a gun so the government cannot control you. And as far as a, you know, some of the benefits of having a gun, uh, other than to protect yourself from tyranny, um, are just the ability to have a weapon to hunt with and to protect yourself. Those are not addressed in the Constitution, but those, those are something that guns are very, very useful for. As far as self-protection, uh, I can still carry. And... Um, yeah, that's for the protection of myself because it's also my belief that the first responder to any crime is the victim. And it's the way I protect myself and my family. So anyway, um, what options would I agree to as far as what type of gun control? None. Uh, I believe that every American has the right to own any reasonable weapon. Uh, my way of defining that is uh, the type of weapon uh, a civilian would have to perform the duties of a soldier or to defend themselves against an invading army or an enemy soldier. Uh, that would pretty much include any type of automatic rifle such as the AR-15 or the AK-47. Um, I, I think that that is a reasonable response. Now, the reason I say reasonable is because when you make that argument, right away any gun-grabbing liberal will make the unreasonable argument that says, well, why doesn't that include rocket launchers, tanks, tanks nuclear bombs, and jets? Well, that is an unreasonable response. The individual American, the people, have the right to keep and bear arms to maintain a well-regulated militia, not become an individual army. That would be unreasonable. Reasonable is that if an enemy soldier has a rifle, so should you. Uh, reasonable limitation, um, again, uh, even full automatic rifles. I believe the individual has a right to own those However, I understand the need to have some sort of regulations involved in that. So anyway, uh, I'm not advocating anarchy or lawlessness in any way. In fact, the individuals I've, I've known and historically who own uh, legal firearms and have concealed carry permits are some of the most um, responsible people I've, I've known of or met. So anyway, I don't want to go on because believe me, I can go on a long time discussing this, but I, I don't have to explain it to you guys because I'm sure we're all on, on, in agreement here. So thank you very much, Mr. Georgia Arms, for this giveaway that you're having. Good luck to everyone else. There's a bunch of prizes there. So uh, competition should be pretty light in this. So anyway, good luck to everyone else. This is OIF Eagle. Out. Oh.